I am going to do a demonstration of making black rice ball stuffed with ham. Again, here are the material that we're going to use. We have the black rice. And I have some season here I have West Indian pepper, I have regular white onion, red onion, and I have some sweet pepper. And that will be mixed into the black rice. Again, black rice is also referred to as forbidden rice because it was only fed to emperors in China. So I have some oregano here that I'm going to chop to help garnish towards the end. I have here the, the ham mixing bowl where I'm going to whip up the egg and I have some amount of flour to do a light coating right a very light coating and it involves flour it's about four tablespoons of flour small amount of garlic powder and red pepper powder you don't want to overpower the balls and again i have my disposable gloves here disposable gloves we look at them disposable those i'll be using call them food grade gloves and also some of the, the powdered seasoning i'll be using cumin also some complete season again i'm not advertising any product and i will be using maybe as drizzle some peanut sauce right? and then all the other material are here right so remember it is the channel malachi m room when we look at malachi perspective we're going to do demonstration I'm going to add the spice, so the red onion, sweet pepper, that's green sweet pepper, bell pepper, white onion, and the red pepper. I'm going to add a little cumin and the reason why I'm going to add the cumin is because of the, the pork. Oh, this is not the cumin, this is the complete spice. I'm use a larger opening so I could get some more. I don't want to overpower either. Alright, now I'll use the cumin. Then the cumin will overpower if you are not careful with the amount, we just want the cumin flavor. Alright, so that looks like it. So I'm going to mix with my hands. I'm going to mix. I take it over. And the aim is to mix in similarly like we are making meatballs. So we want to mix in all of that spice. spice we don't want to again this black rice was cooked a little soft in order for it to cling so when I add the, the whipped egg then we can shape them out for, for frying then there it is moving to the egg Dispose of the trash. So I'm going to whip up this egg. Move that out of the way. I'm 
and again you can put your own twist to it because I may not even add all the egg I want to reduce the amount of moisture so we get them as firm as possible then we don't have to get this egg creamy this egg so I'm gonna pour maybe from that large egg I'm gonna pour about half right leave a little you could maybe make a few with Again, we have to be careful with egg and then I'm going to dig in again to mix. Dig in again to sort and make that. Mix, I want to get the egg nicely spread all over. And again, I think I have this done. Nicely spread. Yeah, there it is. So this would have been finished. Okay. And this would have been so I can get ready to shape my eyeball so in the meantime I am going to light the stove and have the oil heating so I am back having lit the stove the pot is getting hot I'm going to do a demonstration so I'm going to take up about one and a half spoon amount of the black rice I'm going to press it a little I'm going to take, let me bring up the hammer a little closer, move that out of the way. Two little cubes of the ham. And I'm going to sort of cover it. Cover it and try to shape it into a ball. Right? I would have done a few already and if you, you look at you, I have a few of them. But it's just for demonstration. So I would have three there. Place them in this little container then i will dip so i have four there let me do one more so one spoon and a half flat it out a little put two inside again this can be had for breakfast could be had for any meal So you may have some leftover rice and you may use any rice but because I you know I have this black rice I got it from a sister of mine so I place five and I'm so thankful I need to show her this video so there I have my demonstration of the black rice ball stuffed with ham so i'm going to check the oil so i'm going to take off one of these food grade gloves for a while we're going to check the oil you can smell i play some some garlic in it and i use a smaller pot such that let me get this light on all right a smaller pot again i think it's really hot now so i'm going to start coating the bars and dipping a little bit hot I put some garlic there to sort of infuse some flavor into the vegetable oil so here is my and I'm going to use one hand so I here I'm using one hand so I'm going to take up the ball try and shape it use a light flour at the aim again and the ball doesn't have to be let me get the other gloves on so I can maybe sort of roll it doesn't have to be a round ball you know, try and get it as roll Having done a demonstration, let me check on the ones I have in. I'm going to turn them a little again. You look at the color, it's getting a little golden even though it's black. That is what we want. So I put the ones in that has the, the egg wash, two of them. Oops, that one fell. And then there goes the other. So I have five of them for demonstration. Again, they are going to look black because remember it is black rice. So I can take off my gloves. And next time we look, you will see the finished product being presented and for your approval. Again, it is Malachi perspective. We are at the final stage. We are making black rice balls stuffed with ham so i would have fried 
the black rice balls. So here, I'm going to put that one. Two. Four. I'm going to serve four. What I'm going to do initially, I had planned on using only the peanut sauce. So I'm going to put a little of the peanut sauce in the middle to sort of maybe help with color contrast. I'm going to add some tomato ketchup. And again, I am not promoting any, any brand. Put a little in the middle. Again, you could use whatever dip you want. So I don't want to overpower these balls. Right. So in that little dip, I'm going to put maybe two or three cubes of the ham. Looking for some nice cube. Yes. Three cubes of the ham. ham. Then I'm going to garnish you now with my oregano. Oregano, oregano to be seen. Alright, so let me move away and match some of the materials. So there you have it. The black rice ball, about four of them. Ham with the dip in the middle. This garnish with oregano. Again, drop a comment. Let me know what you think about it. 